I'm here with the Merton Music Foundation, today's charity supported by the Wimbledon Foundation. Ladies, lovely to see you. How are you both today? Oh, very well, thank you. Look at the weather. Look at the beautiful weather you brought with you. <laughs> I know. So firstly, just talk us through what what is the Merton Music Foundation, please? Well, we're based in the London Borough of Merton and our job is to serve all the children in the borough with musical activities. We work in all the schools, um, helping support music teaching. We provide instrumental lessons and then we run a big music centre for children who want to play in bands and orchestras and enjoy all that sort of ensemble music making. And have the children that you know you help, have they ever had a, a background in music? It varies hugely. Okay. We uh, take youngsters from being about six and then some of them stay with us till they're 18 through their secondary education and then some of them even go off to study music at university and music college. Wow, what a great start. And so maybe just talk us through, I don't know, just a little bit more about it in this individual projects yeah, that maybe the Women of Foundation help you with. We've had two projects in, in the last couple of years, um, both of which have involved working with music but cross art stuff so we've had a, a fantastic project that brought art and music together and another where we had music and drama and that reached about 500 young people key stage two so so primary age who would never otherwise have had that sort of chance and uh, they've produced some fantastic pieces of work we've worked with some wonderful artists to to collaborate and bring the whole thing together um, and we're just incredibly grateful to the foundation for the funding that, that, that's allowed us to do that. Absolutely, absolutely. Have you got any maybe personal or individual stories from children who have taken part and what they've maybe gone on to do? Well, we like to think that this is an opportunity when they come to us to actually um, expand all the horizons and to aim for the stars. So, you know, we support a lot of our youngsters as they go into the National Children's Orchestra, into the National Youth Orchestra, and students who might have started in a very humble way from a background where there wasn't much music at home, who finally gone through with us and end up at Music College. And we're incredibly proud of all these youngsters that go on to make music their life. Absolutely. And also, you can hear these youngsters in action at Wimbledon. They're performing tomorrow, which is Thursday, and then again on Friday, just talk us through what they'll be performing and maybe the songs they'll be playing. We're so lucky to get invited here and we're so grateful for the opportunity. So our youngsters come in on Thursday morning and that's our concert band. Uh, there's about 70 of them, so it's a wonderful huge sound and it's conducted by our colleague Norma Whitson, who's been doing it for years, who's very popular with the crowds here. And we'll be playing uh, Purple and Green, of course, because of course. We, have to, <laughs> we love playing that. And there'll be an ABBA medley, a Steve, Stevie Wonder medley, songs from the shows, a huge range just so that the crowd can enjoy it while they're getting ready for the tennis. Absolutely a wide range and Sue I mean what does it mean for the children to perform here at Wimbledon? I think it's the highlight of their year and we partly know that because we are allowed to bring a few parents and the fight for <laughs> getting to the front of that line is huge. It's a huge thing um, yeah. and I think perhaps we don't realise living in the borough um, and, and being part of, of what happens every year, I don't think we realise sometimes what an extraordinary thing it is and, and that people who don't have the opportunity to come you know it's like a dream come true really for them and now we're a bit blasé and old hat about it because we've been doing it for 15 years something like that now haven't but the, the children, children absolutely yeah. love it absolutely mm. love it um and obviously wimbledon is iconic is there anywhere else you performed which is just as iconic as here well, we do perform locally mm -hmm. in what venues we can find, but our favourite venue that we get invited to every two years is the Royal Albert Hall, and that's a fantastic opportunity. And we take 1,500 local children to the Albert Hall every two years for a fantastic celebration of music. And just finally, what does the relationship with the Wimbledon Foundation and the Merton, Merton Music Foundation actually mean to you? We believe we need to be networked within our community. We really value our links with all the organisations in the borough and you're a very important part of that for us. Absolutely. Well, ladies, look at the beautiful day you have ahead of you. Enjoy your day at Wimbledon. Thank you, Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you.